What's up guys, I'm Poly Popo and thank you for coming to the channel. Uh, what we're going to do today is sync up two MPCs to use them kind of like a C board. Uh, if you haven't seen a C board, you play your chords on one and the notes on the other one. So that's kind of what we're going to do. But to sync up your MPCs, if you notice the sequence is moving on here along with on the MPC over here. To do that, all I did was hit menu and turn my sync to Ableton Link. Um, you might have to go into your gear icon here and go to your Wi-Fi settings and make sure both of these are on the same Wi-Fi. You can do this with a cell phone or with your home network as long as you have access to Wi-Fi. Like, you can literally be in your car and have your own Wi-Fi with your phone. So we got these synced up. Again, we just hit menu and turn that to Ableton Link after we turn the Wi-Fi on both. Um, all I'm going to do here is select the same instrument. I'm going to go here and yeah you can play drums and everything on here and melodies over here and they'll sync up. I'll show you that too but most important for me I want to show you this. So check this out. Give me a second here. I'm going to load up a piano and then get one over here Go to my plugin. Hi, same same instruments. All right, we're gonna do two the same thing here. All right, so check this out here. What I got going on over here, if I hit pad performs, this button right here, you'll notice I got it on notes over here. Okay, I'm gonna change this to chords. So now I'm on chords. I go to pad perform over here. Same, same thing. Instead of chords, I'm going to leave it on notes. So now I'm ready. Check it out. All right. So again, check it. I'm going to play chords over here. And they're synced up. Remember, the lines are moving over here on the main. You can see Ableton Link on both of them. So I'm just going to check this out. I'm gonna hit record, hit record. There it is. I'll put hit stop on that one. We're only hearing this one. Now we're hearing this one. And this one will come right in. What is dope about this workflow, guys? It happens to the best of us. Kind of just crashed on me, but it's the first time I've done that. Let's show it some love and redo it. Go to track two. Drums, nothing. I'm make some drums and we'll wrap this up.
what's dope about this is now I can control these modules and these modules with one. I can do my kicks and stuff. And with this one, I just think that it's really cool because there's no way I would be able to play. No way possible. And again, whenever you're going MIDI out and you hit pad perform, you can play your favorite synths with these chords as well. I mean, there's no way I could throw down those chords. So I thought it would be something really, really cool to share with you guys. Again, all we did, guys, we just took the Ableton Link and we made sure that it said Ableton Link on both of them. And this is just a good way to sync up two of your devices. If you have an Akai Force, this works really, really great too. And I just thought this was something really cool. And to be able to play like, on a seaboard, something you already have, because it's something I've considered getting. But if you already have it, why, why get it again? Again, guys, I'm Polly Popo. I thank you guys very much for coming out. I'll see you guys on the next one.